What's up, YouTube? Simply Bro. And Simply Danny. Here, we've got a new product for you today. It is the new Speed Duel set, the first uh, core Speed Duel set ever. It's Arena of Lost Souls, named after a very special episode of the original Yu-Gi-Oh! TV show. Super exciting. We're going to pop it open. We're going to get started right now. Dan, are you ready? I'm ready. All right, let's do it. So this is the first box. And I say the first box because we may open uh, more than one box. We'll see how it goes. Uh, the Possibly goal, up to three. Up to three, yeah. Up to three. So we're looking to... What are we looking to do, Dan? What are we trying to do? We're trying to get you all this, the Ultras. All of the Ultras. All, how many of them are there? There are eight. There are eight and Ultras. And eight of the... Uh, the the Supers, yes. And there are no Rares, only uh, Ultra Super. And... Uh, oh, nope. That's right. That's right. Just kidding. Yep. <laughs> Watch out. Old habit. Here we go. All right. Okay, Dan, let's do it let's together, do it. right? All right, first pack. What are we looking for? We're looking for Sphere Karibos, right? Oh. Ooh, Straight nice. Away. Straight you away. You start off strong there. All right, so we got, actually, yeah, Conscription, Decayed Commander, Dragon Zombie, Desert Twister. Oh, oh no. All right, nice. and a Royal Flush. Very cool. So the first Ultra and Super come down in the first two packs. That's so what were your other cards? Uh, other okay, cards, I got, I got Decayed. Decay, yeah. yeah. D spell and magicians unite. Nuts. Nice, nice, classy cards, man. Wow, a lot of really pretty old cards. Nice. Um, so royal flush, that's a new Yugi skill, and then desert twister is a special summon that you have to banish for, which is pretty cool. Um, I mean, I think it's pretty cool. I don't, I don't think he's like insane or anything, but he's definitely the first one in this grouping, in like the that allows for that kind of hand special summoning. So you pretty much get a free summon. But yeah, first first ultra. There it is. There it is. Ooh, snake. Oh, snake creeper. Here. Snake. Well, no, what did we say? JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Oh, plus, plus Medusa. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that, that's crazy. Just oh, and the diffusion wave motion. Yeah, that is that's a, a that's a classic card. There used to be an old combo with that card. Nice. Clown Zombie, dude. That Clown actually uh, debuted in the show along with Dragon Zombie. Um, really creepy cards. Like you can show them, show a little more. Yeah, and super creepy cards, like very unnerving yeah, for me yeah. as a kid when I was watching the show. <laughs> really scary. So Conscription again, Decay Commander again, Dragon Zombie, Ooh, and hey, nice. another super King's Knight. So uh, the whole Yugi uh, Arcana Joker, um, the whole Royal Flush mechanic, the whole where he pulls out all three knights and then summons a really bad boss, a, ba a bad, badass boss monster. <laughs> The big boy. The big boy. That's the big it. boy. That's it. Go ahead. Oh, your gravekeeper's ambusher. Nice, really good. Queen's card. knight. Misty Cosmic clown zombie again. Yeah, there it is. So that ambusher, dude, that's really strong support for gravekeepers, and they were already pretty strong. I'm not gonna lie. So there's the. That's great the main addition. Of yeah, actually, uh, that and Necro Valley, which is in the form of Tomb of the Pharaohs, right? Exactly. Uh, great mammoth of Goldfine. Man, that is a creepy. It's a. It's just it's like a, a cyclops. cyclops. <laughs> yeah, it's a, Wow. Got the one eye. Yeah, we got the one eye. <laughs> <laughs> I got Veil of Darkness, Amazonas Spy. Yeah, another spy. The Shallow support. Grave, and oh! You got him, man! Hey, nice! Knight Joker. Yeah, that's Sick. it. Arcana Knight Joker. That's exactly. what it was. I couldn't remember to save my exactly. life, man. That's pretty. Wow. Do you want to read the effects of that guy? Wow, yeah, I can read it. So, uh, I guess. I, I'll read this one, you get to read the next one. Yeah, so it next. takes Queen's Knight, Jack's Knight, and King's Knight, so the three knights. Uh, a fusion of this can only be done with the above materials. Once per turn, when a spell trap card or monster effect is activated that targets this face-up card on the field, you can discard the same type of card and negate the effect. It doesn't destroy, but it is 3,800, which is massive. Um, that is huge. And in speed duels, that's... That's, that's it. Yeah. almost... That's insanity. That's, yeah. <laughs> uh, so we got some big... We do have some big, I realize even bigger boss monsters. They're upping the ante with uh, with this set. They also, uh, there's also a Kaiba, a new Kaiba boss Kaiba! monster. Kaiba! Yeah, it's exciting. Hopefully hey, let's we'll leave that up with our oh, yeah. 20th anniversary. Oh yeah, nice. Yeah. Good idea here, why yeah. don't you, you pulled it. Oh, sleeve, yeah, yeah. yeah, let's do it. I'll get the uh, sleeve that the bad desert well, twister. The Matching they, clay mat. They are pretty though, know, they really are. Konami outdid themselves with these sleeves. Yes, All right, so do. there we go, let's keep going. Yeah, yeah. So far we're doing pretty good. We're not even halfway through this box. This is pretty excellent. It's like a safari out there. Love it. Oh, great man with the gold find. Mystic Horseman, dude. Oh my gosh, I remember these cards. Magical Ghost. Oh, I have So where do you friends. remember these from? The actual cards when they first came out or the TV show? Both. It was definitely yeah. both, yeah, because I um I played in the original five sets. The original oh, there's another King's Knight. 
in the original uh, five sets. The Buster Blader, dude. Yes, Buster Blader. Armored Zombie, Shield and dude, Sword. All these guys, right? Here. Yeah, I remember all these cards. Um, and it's honestly really nice to see him again. I'm really glad Konami decided to do this because this is definitely a nostalgia player's format. Mm. Like it's for people. And I mean, for a new player like me, it's, it's very also simple. yeah, it's an easier it's way great. to get. In I the can game pick too. this up. For sure, no you problems. picked up Duel Links yeah. in no time, so that's pretty much the same. Only now you have to acquire the physical card. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you have Which, to, to be spend honest, a little money. Well, this is money. fun. Acquiring them is pretty crazy because there's not guaranteed rares no. in each pack. Mm -mm. So, but the boxes are only like thirty-five bucks instead of right. fifty to eighty. So, Ooh, Skull that. Seven. I like that card a lot. Oh yeah. Classy card, man. Zombie Tiger. <laughs> Look at it. Ugly Ooh. guy. He's so ugly. And so nice. Another super. Um, that's actually a pretty cool card. It gives us... Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. Right so, equip only to a warrior monster. It gains 700 attack after damage calculation if the equipped monster battled a dragon monster. Destroy that monster at the end of the battle phase. Nice. So, wow. Yeah, that's, that's, that's actually really cool. Yeah, so what you would do with something like this is you'd equip it to somebody, any warrior really, and it's a huge boost. Right. 700 is actually pretty big. So you could equip to any warrior, and if even if they're bigger than you, and it's a dragon, which dragons are actually popular, blue eyes are popular. Oh, so um, that's a good way to take out blue eyes. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Which and it's super, which is great because yeah. it's foil. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, Heart Ooh, dragon. White elephant's gift. That's another nice. good one, right? Yeah, draw. You get to draw with cards like that. So you get to send one pretty much non-effect monster, which means you can send um, any monster that doesn't have effect in its type. Okay. So say it's a vanilla or a vanilla fusion, which means it just says fusion right. or it just says monster. Yeah. Or whatever car monster type it is. Okay. Like uh, if it just says warrior. So any vanilla card. You get to draw two cards. Block! Hey, Attack. That's nice. I like it. <laughs> Bust a blade. Ooh, Ooh yeah. common charity. Yeah. That's another, another good one. You get to draw pretty much doing kind of the same thing, only you banish. I believe you banish, right? Yeah, banish one normal from your hand. Uh, and it has to be from hand. Yeah, right. so it's a it's actually still really a cool card. They added a lot of draw. There's Veil of Darkness, which is another one. Uh, during your draw phase, if you draw a dark monster, you can reveal any number of them, send them to the grave, and you can draw one more card. So if you have one dark monster in your hand after um, your draw phase, if you draw a dark monster, you can discard it to draw another card. So you can kind of load your grade, uh, right. sort of, kind of, but it, it is a permanent spell, so it's kind of hard to keep around with Twister in this set. Ooh, Rabid Horsey. Yeah, that's a classic fusion. That guy looks like a complete bad. Yeah, he is definitely angry. <laughs> Let's see, there we go. Whiptail Crow. Amazon a Spy. Really cool card. Nice. All right, we got to keep rolling. How are we doing here? On this actually, box. not bad. One box, we got four Supers, two Ultras so far. It's looking pretty good. Uh, there's Ooh. another Super, King of the Skull Servants. Ooh, and look at this. Oh, nice, nice. I wonder which one it is. So yeah, so I'll go ahead and, and yeah, pop you show this that guy. off, and then we'll check out one. King of the Skull Servants. The original attack of this card is the combined number of King of the Skull Servants and Skull Servants in your grave times a thousand. When this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the grave, you can banish one other King of the Skull Servants or Skull Servant from your graveyard, special on this card. Pretty cool. That sounds epic. Yeah, pretty cool. He's recurring. Uh, he's a recurring zombie nightmare, dude. Yeah, <laughs> I like him. King of the Skull Servants. Yeah, I know, right? And it's Ooh, straight, straight to the, to the grave. grave. Go ahead, read it. All right, straight to the grave is all dinosaur, zombie, and rock monsters on the field gain 200 attack and defense. Mm -hmm. And since it's um, a skill, you can start the duel with it. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. I definitely uh, think that Bones is going to be an interesting, and in a good way, mm -hmm. in the best way. Bones will be an interesting uh, zombie deck for sure. I'm excited to see how well, well zombies perform. We're going to do a duel, are we? We are. And one of us is going to be using this Bones Ooh. card right here, Call of the Haunted. Yes, very this is nice. Fantastic. So it pretty much does what normal Call of the Haunted does, only it's a skill that you get to set at the beginning of the game. So you're pretty much guaranteed a Call on, and they can't MST it until you activate it. So it's pretty much just there and ready to use. It's pretty cool. Like it's actually really good, and I'm glad they printed it Ultra. So there's another Ultra for us. I think you guys might have seen that in that. Super secret sneak peek that Simply Unlucky did of uh, 12 packs of this set. Some of you, just a few of you. Right, just, for sure. just a few, it's very select few. Um, if you got a chance to see it before we uh, we put it back, we pulled it back down really quick just to kind of yeah. tease a few. All right, so there we go. I got a sword and shield, Amazon Spy, Magical Ghost. Nice. That actually, the wicked, <laughs> the wicked, wicked yep. Flameberg. <laughs> yeah, Flamberg. 
Flat it's dice? A, yeah, it's a type of monstrously huge sword. And oh, this one yeah, yeah, negates yeah. grave effects. So if a monster equipped with that destroys another monster, right. and it has an effect that goes off in the grave, like Legion the Fiend Jester, okay. or like Blue Dragon Summoner, you don't get that effect. It just negates uh. it, and it says it says no. If that's equipped to the monster used to destroy it. So really? It's pretty good. Actually, surprisingly, could be decent. Yeah, and it's 500 attack, so that's not bad. As long as it's at least 500 attack, it can be, can be okay. Hey, hey, hey there's hey, another hey. one. Nice. Hey! Half shut. Ooh. Diffusion wave. Yep, there it is again. And limit impulse. So this card is interesting. It pretty much says, hey, use three cards um, to tribute summon for a two card tribute summon, which I think is interesting for <laughs> sure. Hey, instead of paying two cards, you don't have to summon, you can just pay three. You pay an extra card to not have to summon them, which is cool. I guess it is cool when you think about it. I'm going to leave the last pack of Destiny for you. Hey, Simply I appreciate that. Oh, I appreciate yeah. That. Oh, yeah. Pull that fourth Ultra for us, okay? Oh, I will. Oh, yeah, you're going to have to because I didn't. <laughs> okay, so our fourth ultra. JoJo's Bizarre pack. Adventure meets Medusa. Right there, guys. That's that. Oh, In the meantime, I'm going to sleep this call to Han. Yeah, look at that. Beautiful. Magicians okay. Unite, D Spell, Gravekeeper's Ambush, and Queen's, Queen's Knight. Knight. Queen's Knight. That's okay. Hey, this Queen's is Knight's still not a bad box. we got three ultras, yep. six supers. Um, definitely so not a bad box. Six. Uh, no, we got one double. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> For sure. That's so all right. Five different supers, which means there are only three other supers to show, and there are definitely more ultras. But and you've already seen some of you've already seen this one. Right. Um, I definitely can't wait to see the Sphere Karibo. That's what I'm excited for. I don't know. Are you yeah. pulling that or yeah. am I pulling? I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> all right, you ready, dude? I'm ready. All right, so let's do let's this. Do let's, let's get rip to the some next packs. Box. Yeah. Let's uh, let's go through these ones a little bit quicker. It's like a, a revisiting of my childhood, man. This is awesome. It's just like when we opened the Speed Duel decks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was like, good. It was it was awesome. All right, love it. Shallow Graves actually, I think it could be really good, uh, especially in in um, what is it? Potentially, maybe even in Gravekeepers, but any deck that really plays with the Grave, or doesn't allow others to. Okay. Um, so there's a Flamberge. Boom. Keep going. We're moving a little faster. I like it. Oh, yeah, let's, I like let's, it. Let's see what you get. These guys. Hey, oh, no, King's no, Knight. No, That's okay. No, off to the side. Yeah. Set that off to the exactly. side. Exactly. <laughs> and Queen's Knight again. That's okay. Right, let's on, keep it going. Oh, you got one. I believe ultras. in you. I believe in you. The snake hair. Oh yeah, look at her. Is she, isn't she gorgeous? I can't even confirm if that's fe a female or not. Honestly, I can't. I really can't. That could be JoJo with a with a. <laughs> <name, honestly. laughs> Such an unnerving card. I know. <laughs> oh, 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 there it is. Otherwise, ultimate. Oh, dragon. that is beautiful, dude. Now that you gotta slave it. Is fantastic. You gotta oh, slave yeah. it. Oh, wow. It up. Look at that. Forty five hundred attack. And it loses to Sword of the Dragon Soul. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. That is excellent. I also got a foil. It's Meteor Black Dragon. Very Ooh. cool. I'm going to set it down here. That's one we haven't seen yet. Um, we have seen those. We have <laughs> seen all of those cards. So yeah. this, this set's also kind of unique because of how many cards. Yes. Are, right? it's and very, the rarities. Exactly. It's very short, very short. Only three rarities. Very short set. 50 cards, I believe. 50 total. And five of those are skills. Right. Two Yugi and three Bones. Um, and for those of you that by chance haven't seen the original Yu-Gi-Oh! show, it's a pretty cool episode. Not going to lie. So you should definitely check it out. Arena of the Lost Souls. Um, same name as the set. Wow. Um, Do you think that that will be uh, a theme? A continued theme? Yeah. I, I don't Just see why them, not. Them kind of... Uh, yeah. Taking the show and then yeah, I actually, printing speed duels. I don't see why they wouldn't. It's a great idea. And to be honest, it works. They don't have to just strictly keep the set to whatever the the uh, you know the, the namesake is. Right. The Wasteland Conscription. Really, really cool card. I like how they implemented excavating into a, a nostalgia-oriented uh, game, for sure. Excavating, as you guys probably realize, isn't a super new uh, or old mechanic. Just four years ago or so, I think four or five years ago. With the um, onset of cards like Bandit Karibo and what are the other ones? You probably don't know them. Uh, oh, Sylvans. Man. Sylvans, I think, were a big, big part. Oh, there's Call the Hunt again. Nice. That's Boom. pretty good. I'll keep the ultras. I'll keep the multiple ultras. Up there. We're thinking he's going to be pretty popular on the market. Yeah, absolutely. I definitely think so. If you're going to play Bones, you have to play Call the Hunt. Call the Hunt is just so good. Um, but we need the Karibo. And we need the other Bones ability that people might play instead. It's that Ectoplasm one. The oh, pump. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 
We do need the we need the Sphere Karibo. I agree. Yeah. We need him. Where are you, Sphere Karibo? Oh, that's that's, <laughs> <laughs> that's beautiful. Buster Blader. Oh yeah. Come on, let's get this. Oh, you want to take a whip? Oh yeah. Yeah, we yeah, got yeah, in yeah. honor of simply unlucky right here. That's what that's, that's what this is. Oh, uh, I kind of messed it up. But we're oh, gonna oh, do it, oh, guys. I, I think you it. got it. Nice. Ooh. Ready? Oh yeah, it really does smell good, man. I don't know. It smells I think good, but I've I learned to love it. I've learned. To <laughs> it's like an acquired scent that I wasn't super fond of before, but it, it brings back memories. Ooh, and Twister. Nice. That's, That's a really good. I haven't got that one either. Yeah, and it's definitely going to be played. It's like the some of the best immediate uh, speed two removal in speed duels right now. So it's pay five hundred LP, then tie one face up, spell trap. Yep. On the t uh, on the field and uh -huh. destroy. The only problem that people are having with it, of course, is going to be the fact that it's face up. But Call the Haunted came out with this set, so Ooh. you just wait until they play Call the Haunted, or you set it because oh. they can't twister your twister. So it's a call. <laughs> Otherwise, that'd be twin twister. <laughs> and <laughs> and legendary here next. Yes, yeah. among others. That those among were others. both reprints, by the way. Right. Yeah. What was the original set? You know? uh, oh gosh. You just put me on the spot, man. I don't, yeah. I don't know. I don't, I don't know, man. We need Simply Unlucky for oh, that. Oh, oh, nice. This could be it. This could be yeah, the bones. This could be the third bones skill. Straight it's, to the grave. It's definitely not. It's, not. it's definitely a repeat <laughs> of one we already have. Well, did you read this one? I did you did. You did. No, did you did. Yeah, you read the, the field spell. Oh, like yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Read that over there. And uh, for those of you that haven't read Call the Haunted, uh, I guess we could read it. I mean, I guess. This is one I we haven't seen Oh, so nice. Far. Send you. No, go uh, ahead. You pulled okay. it. <clears throat> yeah. When this card is normal or flip summon, you can add one ritual monster from your deck to your hand. Oh, is that misprinted too? Oh, yeah, it oh. is. It's got a line get, all the way give across. Give him a good that. view of that. It's gotta, you guys got to see this. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He's looking up. He's got I, He's got to find it in the viewfinder. Yeah, you got Oh, Can you we can't, see it? Nope. Yeah. Tilt, maybe tilt them more. Like that. Nah. You no, but there is a it, really, a really line. fine line all the way up and down the card. Mm -hmm. Or through the foil on the card. At least that's cool. So not only did we get a Senju, finally, we got a misprinted Senju. Very cool. Oh, Another Desert, Desert Twister. Twister. That's nice. That is nice, yeah. Should oh, we no. keep this guy? Yeah, Ultras. Yeah. Okay, second box. How many? Okay, so how many have we got here? Uh, we, we had three five. Ultras from the first box, so that means we had uh, four from the second. So we had these. Boom and boom. That it, that's a pretty definitely a better box the second time around. Right. Uh, only because I think. Uh, well, I don't know. It is really cool to pull the Arcana Knight Joker for sure. Yeah, that yeah, is yeah. a really cool card. And we're looking pretty good on there. We just need one more super. Do you know which super it is, Dan? Can Do I guess? know which super it is? Oh yeah, we talked about it already. It's the other bone skill. Right. Yeah. 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 So it's we have to do the third ectoplasm. box. Yeah. Let, exactly. All right. We, we have do to it. do it. We got to do it. Pop all it right, open. So one more box. Here we go. Pop it open, simply, bro. Okay. You got it. Simple. Thank you, Simply Dan. I You're don't welcome. know where the device is, this so I'm just going to use my man hands. And, uh, oh, oh, look at that. That's beautiful. Look at that. Good job. Here we go. Are Excellent. you ready? Work. Let's do it. So, seal box number three coming in. Okay. Hot. Let's do it. Boom. Arena of Lost Souls. I know, right? That's a cool name, isn't it? It is very cool. I imagine All the episode right. is pretty epic. It is, it is. It's a duel between uh, actually, now that I think about it, I think it might have been Joey. It might have been Joey and Bones. It's been a long time. Wow. Let's do it. A little quick. I can't remember to save my life. Wow, that's so sad. That's so sad. Guys, if you happen to remember, or if you just know because you're awesome, could you please tell us who the original Bones duel was with or against? Oh, oh nice! Another one, and I pulled that's Shin. Uh, Sindri. Very cool, dude. That that's is a very awesome. cool card. It is, isn't it? And it's huge. <laughs> well, Thirty-eight hundred. Yeah. Just set it over the side. Yeah. Kind of feel bad putting it on the side. I know. I know. You know, there's only eight you know, of them. Now, you know, you make me wanna. <laughs> We're gonna put the dupes. We're gonna put the dupes over here. The dupes over there. We'll put the dupes over here. Yeah. All the dupes. So we'll start a set. <laughs> All right, is this it? Is this going to be it? Oh, there's Bonesy oh. Boy! <laughs> there's another Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. Oh, man, come can, on. Can this... Oh, oh. Yeah. Where is the Sphere Karibo? <laughs> there we go. Nice. We got it. Ectoplasmic... Nice. You, you grab that Are you sure? Yeah, you grab it. Okay. Explain it to the, to the peeps. It's a skill, so pretty much what that means is you can activate it whenever. Um, 
Oh, thank you. you Once per turn, if you control a zombie monster, you can place one counter on this card. All zombie monsters you control gain 100 attack and lose 100 defense for each counter on this card. Any battle damage you take from battles involving your zo zombie monsters is double. So, okay. if you're feeling a little aggro and risky, maybe give this one a shot because, I mean, there's no end really to how big your zombies can get, but you take double damage, which is kind of kind of scary. And if they yeah. have, what's that card? Sphere Karibo? Sphere, yeah, yeah. And they put your monster in defense position? The one that we don't have. <laughs> yeah. The one that we're going to exactly. get in this box. That's exactly it. No, I, look at those beautiful cards. Look at those beautiful cards. All right, let's do it. Come on. All right, here we go. Here we go. Come on, Sphere Karibo. Where are you? Oh, it's Great Keeper's Ambusher again. How you doing, buddy? Come on. Sphere Karibo. Come on. Show yourself. So wait, we need more than Sphere Karibo, though. Who else do yeah, we need? Yeah, we need... Uh... Oh, who are the other? <laughs> I cannot remember. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, we're so good at this. Oh, there we go. Oh, Michizuri. Yes. That's right. Oh, wow, almost forgot. Yes. Uh... That's an exciting card to have in the set, too. You know, not going to lie, we might have... <laughs> we've already pulled two Ultras. <laughs> so it's going to be kind of hard. But no. I believe. I believe. Oh man, We're just come, on. This. come on, come on, come on, ah, Buster Blader, still a cool card, I really do love Buster Blader, every time I see him I think about it, oh, 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 hey, there, there it is, there we go, you got him, Sphere. you want to read him, you read him this time, no, I just read him, read I just read him, this is for you simply Dan, yes this is for me, thank when you, when an opponent's monster declares an attack, you can send this card from your hand to the graveyard, change the attacking monster to defense position, that's pretty good. Okay. Excellent already. <laughs> when you rich exactly, it's already amazing. Uh, when you ritual summon, you can banish the card from your graveyard as one of the monsters required for the ritual summon. So not only is it already good almost all the time, it also has a bonus. You can ritual summon with it if you happen to be one star short or ritual summoning one a one star monster. Right. Is <laughs> is relinquished a one star monster? Huh, interesting. Anyways, so Sphere Karibo, definitely one of the best cards in Duel Links. So I'm definitely expecting it to be oh, one yeah. of the best cards in Speed Duels. Um, it's it's just great. It's just a great, you just, it gives you so much control. Uh, another reason that's why Windstorm of Etiqua is so popular, because it just changes everyone's position. And that's right. so powerful in this game. But boom, we finally got it. Okay. Uh, and now I'm going to do the pack I had open, and it is... Tomb of the Pharaoh. Super Hold exciting. On. So we just have one left to pull? Yes. Well, we've technically pulled three already, I think, at least. Karibo, Ultimate, and Tomb. So Tomb, it's pretty much Necro Valley. Uh, gives you all the bonuses of Necro Valley, except its actual effect. It just gives you the name, so all your other cards bonus from it. Uh, I think Necro Valley, the actual card, would be a little too powerful in, in speed duels, for sure. I'm sorry, I keep blocking the card. Uh, <laughs> sorry guys, Good. but it is gorgeous as an Ultra. I love Foil Necromantic, for sure. And if you don't, I'm sorry. They did it. They, I didn't do it, they did it. For all of those players out there with scars from Necro Valley Duels, <laughs> yeah, there was a time when it was a rough, rough deck to play against. I played it during that time, so actually. <laughs> oh, straight to the grave. Hey. Cool, so if you guys didn't get to see that, it's pretty much like a wasteland. Um, in fact, I kind of want to go grab Wasteland because it's the go. same card. It, Dan, it's the it, same what? card. It, no, it really is the same card. It's exactly yeah, the same. You can play two if you want. They did this for uh, Yami as well in the Yugi deck. So they've got Yami and the Power of Darkness, and they do the oh. same thing. It okay. just gives you one more. So in case you want to play an extra or have one available. All right, here we go. What do we got? Violet Crystal. Really, really interesting card. For sure. Really good to see it again. Armored Zombie. Oh. oh, there we go. It's like a undead Masaki. Oh wait, no, that's the um, that's the commander. Right, that's right. That's the right. commander, isn't it? Uh, what was his name? Cursed Commander. What is it? De Decay. Decay. Decay Commander. That's it. That's a great mammoth of gold. Fine. The Snake here. Jojo. Hey, there's the Decay Commander. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Hey, how you doing there? Hey. <laughs> okay, let's not run role role play. <laughs> hey, if I was role playing though, I'd be mystic. You don't want to be mystic horseman. Yeah. Ooh. Definitely. Ooh, the last pack. Oh, last King pack of the skull servants. There it is, guys. What do you think? Excellent. Pretty cool looking guy. Um, nice purple robe, for sure. 
and it gets huge. Honestly, we did really good here. We almost got all of the uh, of, of the ultras right here. Yeah, we in were, those, we were in those really three close. boxes. We're just missing one, and it's Michizuri, which for those of you that got to see the sneak peek, have already seen it. Exactly. Um, with the supers, though, did we land them all? We did. We did land them all. Good deal. We did. This has been fantastic. Yeah, I agree. So let's go ahead and lay them out for them. Yep. For you guys, so you can see all of them. Let me get the dupes out here. So that's all of them right there. This is beautiful ultras. Some of these ultras, I think, are just absolutely gorgeous. Um, I pretty much. I yeah. really like Sphere Kariba. I do too. That. Uh, the and yeah. you said this is going to be probably one of the most popular. Oh yeah, for sure. This set. Definitely, you can play it pretty much every. It's amazing in any deck. There's no deck it's not good in. Basically, fantastic uh, for speed duels in general. Yes, uh, absolutely. That card is insane. If you've in Duel Links, if you ever get to a relatively competitive point, everybody plays it. But uh, in any case, I'll, what's your favorite one? You said Sphere Karibo? Yeah, I think it's Sphere Karibo. I like him a lot, but it's definitely Tomb of the Pharaoh. It was a hard choice between Blue Eyes Ultimate and Tomb of the Pharaoh. Right. But uh, that's definitely my choice for sure. And you Let like us know what your favorite Ultra card was, guys. For sure. Uh, go ahead, Dan. You were gonna say no, something? I was just going to say. And you like this guy because he's broken or just because he looks good? It just looks good. And okay. there was a time when it was a broken right. When Necro Valley was a broken card. But any Necro Valley uh, foil, I like it. I don't know what it is. It's just that canyon with the sunlight. And it's just magic, dude. It's magic. No, but it's yeah. Yu-Gi-Oh. Excuse me. <laughs> it's you. <laughs> wow, that was good. Uh, in any case, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the opening. I know we enjoyed it. Yeah, right? this was been this has been fantastic. I, I love it. Uh, I love it. I think we did a great job. Uh, three boxes. This is what we pulled. Yeah. Uh, leave your comments below, guys. If you haven't already subscribed, please do so, and don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much, guys. And this is the Simply Squad signing out.